Oh, so everybody is she all for pain because everybody shall know pain. And kind of, oh, kind of figure out Killer B and Fourth Hokage has already been both, as you can tell by the date that was posted. And I had no idea at all. So I, I basically had to look for it, and here it is. Um, now we now we get a uh, look at the gross uh, twenty eight thousand twenty eight point zero uh, for the force twenty five thousand twenty five point zero for the chakra and agility and two hundred eighty thousand twenty eight point zero for the power. Let's go down to their now buffs. But at the same time, you guys can check out the animation what they look like in battle. Uh, let me scroll this a little bit. Okay. Oh, actually, dang it. You can't really see the rest of the um, but I think I'm, I'm you can't really see the rest of the talent. Um, but I'll still, I'll still read to you guys. Uh, massively, massively increase force and agility naturally has 77 sting, 77 percent speed, 55 percent damage rate, 50 percent avoidance rate when on the field. Increase uh, team speed by 90 percent. And HP by 30%, so that's been buffed. Um, it was, I think it was 80% or like 88%. That 80, it was, it was, I think it was like 87% for speed, it was something like that. And then the team HP was 20% to my knowledge, I believe so. Um, then increased teams avoid rate by 30%. Stuff ignores super flash when attacked 50%. Yeah, stuff ignores super flash. When attack 50% chance to clear debuffs on self naturally ignores blind and death seed. So now he now your team is slightly faster with his buff and more HP. Go ahead and make you guys bulkier. Then for the skill, attack all growth rate uh, 350%, 90% chance to explode enemies can't move, cause enemies to lose 100% HP for one round, increase team block rate by 60%. I think it was either four, uh, either forty or fifty. Can break upper limits, decrease enemy strategy and physical defense by thirty percent. Recover fifty for self and thirty for team. So yeah, that's uh, for Farakage and Killer World Killer B and for Farakage's buff. All in all, you know, I I still was going to pass on them anyway. Just as much as I like, you know, they have the DLT. And you know they got the HP for your whole team, and you know the speed. You know y'all was gonna have speed, just uh, the higher it keeps increasing. It's just what they, it's just what they do in terms of the talent and skill. It's just not enough, or it's not enough. It's not enough for me to will the thing. It's not enough for me to willingly replace Guy and Lee. Not saying because I mean, not saying I'm not good. Because if you watch my preview, you watch my video of them when they first came out. I gave my full on opinions. It's just you know. Um, you know, because you know when they when they get buffs, it's not gonna be spectacular. A little, little buff here, a little buff there. So yeah, all in all, um, I don't even know, man. It's just, I mean, it's pretty cool. I mean, they're they're, they're good. Um, I think I said oh, they're mainly for well, they have a lot of well, I think mainly for PVE. Yeah, yeah, I think mainly for PVE. Uh, then you got then you know. Here and there helping for PvP. But all in all, I don't like you saying that. At the, um, but that is the thing. But that is it. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like, leave a comment. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new to the channel, and I will catch you guys later. Peace.